Hi, I'm Brad with Big Family Homestead, and today I've got a quick video for you to figure out an in-the-field test for your goats to see if they have worms or parasites. So let's get busy. Keeping your goats healthy is a very, very important thing, and one easy way that you can check to see if they have a worm problem. This is an in-the-field test that is very, very quick. It doesn't, it's not all-inclusive, but this test basically will check for the main nasty, wasty bugs and worms and parasites. And it's so easy, you're not gonna believe it. And we're gonna show you right now how you can do it in less than 30 seconds. Okay, so here we are with my wife, Krista, and over here coming into the screen, we've got our famous, or ever famous, or infamous, Goat Petunia. There she there is. There she is. Nice sweetheart. And um, Krista's gonna go ahead and show you how you're going to field check your animals for worms and parasites. And how do you do that? All you really do is pull down their lower eyelid and see what color it is. The eyelid? The Yes, the lower eyelid. So you're looking at the eyelid, not necessarily the, the eye. The inside, yes, the inside of the eyelid. You wanna make sure that that is nice and dark pink and reddish color because then that shows that um, she does not have worms. Um, but we give them regular treatment of diatomaceous earth anyway just to prevent that. So our goats stay pretty much yep. worm free. See, the best way to do Oops. this, hold her head. Hold still, sweetheart. No, no, I don't no. think she, she likes the camera. She does not <laughs> like to be dude. She does not like this. Just really quick. All right, that's a good color. And then you switch to the other side. Again, oh. And <laughs> you got good, nice red we color. We got nice, good red color. So she is good with with worms, she does not need to be treated. All right, so that sounds pretty simple. Yep, it is very simple. It's something you can do in the field and just really fast while they're eating their grain. And um, that way you don't have to go to the vet. <laughs> yeah, yep, yep. And we do have other videos like I mentioned, or like I will mention or have mentioned, I can't remember, on diatomaceous earth. And that, that basically is a preventative natural uh, supplement for their diet, yep. or if they do have worms, you can treat them. Yep. All right, coming up on your screen is a link to a actual chart that is a, uh, a chart that shows you the redness of the eyelids for the goats, and when you need to treat, and when you don't need to treat. It's basically a redness chart that's, that's a great way to uh, compare to your goats to see if you need to treat them uh, for worms. Now, the reason why I put these links up here is it's actually a copyrighted uh, document and image, so it would have been wrong and illegal for me to put it up on the screen. So go ahead and click the link and you can look at it there and you can either buy a copy or read what they say on how you can acquire it and uh, check it out. It's very, very good information and it's very beneficial for you and your goats. There's also mo uh, some more other, uh, I think there's one more link that's awesome that you should check out and it's also there on the screen. All right, it's literally that simple. One quick way that you can check to make sure your goats are healthy. And oh yeah, by the way, if they do show signs of worms or parasites, you can check out one of our other videos on a natural way to get rid of them, and that's diatomaceous earth. So check that out if you're having an issue. Keep them goats healthy, keep them happy, and they'll take care of you too. So if you like this video, please don't forget to click like and subscribe. And once and again, here I am, Brad, saying thanks for watching. Have yourself a great day. I'm Brad with Big Family Homestead. I almost forgot one quick thing. See this cool hat? My wife made it. If you like it, you can actually get one at bigfamilyhomestead.com. Uh, even just shoot us an email. We'll do team colors, your favorite colors or whatever, and they're very reasonably priced. So yeah, just thought I'd mention it. I like it. Sweet. Bye.